How's it going, everybody? Hello again. It's so nice to be back out here with you. Chris Hayes is backstage and won't stop freestyle rapping, so it's really getting to be a lot. Uh, meanwhile, oh, uh, it, while we've been here having such a great time, I've switched from water to bourbon. Um, <laughs> thank you. One person's like, hooray, everyone else is like, this guy better speed it up. Um, in the West, the following awards were given. For animation, Carl Carlson Rides Again from The Simpsons, written by Lonnie Steele Sotsand. For on-air pro promotion, television, new media, radio, WCBS AM promos, written by Bill Tynan. And for comedy variety specials, Sarah Silverman, Someone You Love, written by Sarah Silverman. Let's have a round of applause for those. That's right. As this year's awards season has unfolded, fans, critics, and writers alike have pointed out that Best Comedy nominee, The Bear, actually has a lot of pathos, and Best Drama winner, Succession, is really funny. But those aren't the only shows that are kind of confusingly categorized for awards. The lines separating genres are actually blurrier than you think, so I'm gonna read out some descriptions of this year's Writers Guild Award-nominated shows, and I want you to all to yell out comedy, if you think it's comedy, or drama, if you think I'm describing a drama. We good? Pretty clear? Great. Okay, here's the first one. A city's crumbling infrastructure takes its toll on public sector workers and the communities they serve. What do you think? Comedy. Comedy. That's an easy one. Abbott Elementary. Yep. Good one. Good job, everybody. Yep. Good audience. You're on it. Um, number two. This is the second one. Residents of a dilapidated home in Staten Island living under the specter of constant violence do what they have to to survive, learning the value of chosen family along the way. Oh, I'm here in a mixed bag. Comedy, you're right. Drama, unfortunately, no. I'm talking what we do in the shadows. That is what we do in the shadows. Ah, yeah, gotcha. Um, number three, this show is a road trip buddy two-hander where an unlikely intergenerational pair is forced to navigate travel hijinks, awkward moments, and coming-of-age milestones. Drama, that's right. We're talking about The Last of Us. Great job, everybody. You guys do it. You guys know what tone problems really mean, huh? That is, we get it. We know they don't. Great job with the game, everyone. I wanted to get you all prizes, but unfortunately, we only have the budget for a mini room worth of prizes. So, uh, yep, people in the front share. I've got some, it's, the show's been going for quite a while. I got some movie theater snacks for everybody. So, uh, or for four people. So, I'm gonna throw them as far as I think is safe. I see you over there. Yep, we got it. Hell yeah. And then one down this way. And, uh, Thank you very much. That's been the bit. 